Ernestine Crump is a 17-year-old girl who is finding herself. Godfrey is a recently widowed father of two. Uh, Lily is wild. It's family moving from Pensacola, Florida up to Crown Heights, Brooklyn, um, largely due to the death of their mother. For Amina in particular, she's navigating the loss of this maternal guidance in her life, but also like she's going through this phase in her life where she's trying to identify herself, who she is, what she wants, um, what matters to her. She's starting to examine what she believes in and what kind of a life she wants to live. She's finding herself while having just lost her mother. This is the first time that I've really watched someone go on the ride of grieving and then fighting for hope and then grieving again. For Lily, the story is about this person who is completely lost, trying desperately to find a home. Goethe is a, a German woman who has just arrived in New York City in 1950. Um, after having lived through the Second World War in Berlin. And I think quickly realizes that um, she's a little out of her depth. She can't even find the train station. But she does run into Godfrey um, and they form a connection. When we meet Godfrey throughout the play, we are seeing him just making his best attempts to uh, be the best man and the best father and the best leader of this family that he can be. There are just so few plays that appeal to an entire family. You can bring your kids, you can go as an adult. I think there's something for everyone in this play, so come see it.